my channel so excited that you are here thank you so much for clicking on this video it's jody dunn and it's tuesday i'm a day late but i'm bringing you my cvs haul if you are new and you just found me so happy that you are here would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there i would love to welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you and if you are already subscribed thank you so much for coming back to another video i appreciate you so I posted on the community tab um, on Sunday, and I let you know that I kind of changed my plans for the week. Rite Aid, the deals are just so dang hot at Rite Aid that I decided to mix things up a little bit this week and do um, a haul video on Monday for Rite Aid. So if your notifications are not turned on, and you want to be notified whenever I post something, including things on the community tab, make sure you click that bell. But also, if you're ever wondering like, wait, where the heck is her video? Because I did have some people like, what happened to your CVS video? Always check the community section of the channel. I would, I would always post an update if I change things up from my norm. And I especially posted an update because uh, I announced a gift card giveaway. No, I didn't. I announced an insert giveaway <laughs> in my Walgreens haul. And I know that you are all anxiously awaiting, but because I told you that I would be drawing the winners in my CVS haul and then I switched things up, I didn't want to draw it in my Rite Aid haul uh, because it, my Rite Aid videos don't get a ton of views because not everybody has Rite Aid. Like I totally get it. If you do have Rite Aid, you should keep an eye Rite Aid. So anyways, we are doing our CVS haul today and I will be drawing the insert winners. We're also running over to Rite Aid. <laughs> That's how hot the deals are. And I'm gonna do one more transaction for the week at Rite Aid. Um, that's it. That's, that's, oh, I did want to tell you, I know a lot of you love Donna Jean. We don't get the woo very often anymore, uh, but Donna Jean is turning 12 tomorrow. If you would like to wish her a happy birthday, I will make sure that she sees the comments. She will be so, so excited. Um, so just wanted to give you that little update that it's my baby, my baby's birthday. Oh my gosh. I can't believe she's going to be 12. She's almost as dang tall as me. She wears the same size shoes as me. Oh my gosh. Like I just can't even believe it. So grateful I have grandbabies now because I miss having the little kids around. You know, if you're a mom, you know. But I love my girls. They're growing into wonderful, wonderful women or young women. So anyways, all right, we're going to run into CVS and grab a couple of awesome deals that I was excited about. And then we're gonna run to write it and do an awesome transaction as well. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go grab some awesome deals. Happy Tuesday. I am in the CVS a day late, but here and excited about basically one deal in particular and that is the spend 30 earn back 10 because it includes the mr clean magic erasers i was so happy when i went to rite aid uh on sunday and saw that they were included in a deal at rite aid too we don't get deals on these things very often and when i can grab something that i would be buying anyways and get it for a spectacular deal that makes me so happy so i'm gonna grab these eight count sheets that are priced at $4.39 in my store. And then I'm gonna grab the two pack of the Magic Eraser that are priced at $4.59 in my store. And these are buy one, get one half price. And this Sunday save, we got coupons on Magic Erasers. Four count or higher, I think that says $2 off. And one to three count is $1 off. So I'm gonna use these four coupons. And on Shopkick, we do have between scan kicks and purchase kicks a dollar and two cent cash rebate back, which I was so happy to see that because it was not available for my Rite Aid transactions. So to get me up to 30, I'm gonna go ahead and grab two laundry products. These are my favorite scent beads. I wish they would have had more than one, but these are priced at six dollars and 99 cents. And then I'm gonna grab our favorite dryer sheets that are priced at $6.99. I'm just gonna use digital coupons for these two. I have a $2 digital coupon for the scent beads and a dollar digital coupon for the dryer sheets. 
And I'm only at $27.44 with these products. So I need to grab one more thing to get me up to my $30 spend requirement. And I'm gonna go for one of these small spaces. These are also buy one, get one half price. I would have grabbed another one, but it'll take it under the $2 mark and I wouldn't be able to use a coupon. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and grab one. So now I'm at $31.33 and I'm gonna use this $2 coupon on these small spaces. And I received an email threshold coupon for $5 off when I spend 30 that I'm gonna use in this transaction, which will drop me down to 15.33, earning back a $10 extra buck and submitting to Shopkick for a dollar and two cents. That would make all these products just $4.31, but on this card, I did receive $4 in the Epic Beauty event rewards that I never counted as a reward earned. Therefore, that's free money to me. So these are all just gonna be 31 dang cents. And I haven't grabbed my free beauty gift for the month on this card. And these scunsies that are, I don't know, they're like nylon. Donna has informed me these are her favorite because they're super soft. They're like $4.39 or $4.59, something like that. Anyways, this coupon will make them totally free. All right, we're gonna switch cards and do another transaction. But before I do that, I wanted to announce the insert giveaway winners. So the first winner is Amber Davis. Congratulations. You are gonna get two of the inserts that have those awesome $2 Scott and $2 Cottonelle and a whole bunch of other awesome coupons. My email is always listed down in the description box. Send me an email and with your address so I can get those in the mail to you ASAP. And then the second winner that is going to win two more of those inserts is Mia Girl. Congratulations, Mia. Uh, send me an email and I will get those inserts out to you. Ladies, I need you to claim these by Thursday at noon or I will have to draw a new winner because I want those inserts to go to somebody quickly so they can use them. All right, let's move on to our second transaction on a different card. I'm again going to grab some more magic erasers because I'm so excited about this deal. So I'm going to grab the um, eight count sheets. Again, buy one, get one half price. And I'm going to use the $2 off insert coupons for these. And I exclusively use self-checkout. And what I do at self-checkout is I scan the product and then I scan the coupon especially, I do it no matter what now, but especially when I'm mixing in like manufacturers because the coupons can tend to attach to other things. All right, these are priced at dang $11.29, the dual pack of the Febreze um, refills, and they are buy one, get one half price as well. So I'm gonna grab two of these and I'm gonna use the $5 insert coupons on each one of these. And if they would have had another one of the downy scent beads that I love, I would have grabbed that, but they don't. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab our favorite dryer sheets again at $6.99, and I will use a $1 digital coupon for this one. So the two Mr. Clean, the two Febreze, and the one downy dryer sheets totals me $30.50. After all my coupons, it would drop me down to $15.50 and I would earn back a $10 extra buck. $5.50 for these five products, not a bad deal. But I did receive an email threshold coupon on this card as well. For I have to spend $40. So I'm gonna build my transaction up to $40. I'm gonna grab the You Buy Kotex deal. They are buy one, get one half price and buy any two, earn back $2 in extra bucks. Look at how lucky I got. My store had two of the $1.89 packs. Look at how bare the You Buy Kotex is right now, OMG. So these two are gonna total me $2.83. I don't have any coupons. This is a great newbie friendly deal. I'll pay the $2.83, earn back $2. Makes both of these just 83 cents. So I need a little bit more to get me up to $40. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab the Suave deodorant. I swear my store was priced at $3.29. The price is now $2.99. I've never seen them lower the price. Anyways, they're buy one, get one half price and buy two, earn back $2 an extra bucks. I have this email coupon that I received from signing up from Unilever's email. You just go to unilever.com. They email you a whole bunch of coupons. I actually got this one in May for my birthday. It's $2 off any two suave. 
and I had only printed one copy and used one copy so far, and you can print two. So these two will total me $4.48 after my $2 coupon. I'll pay $2.48, earn back $2 in extra bucks. Makes my cost 48 cents for both. So I'm only at about $38 in product right now. Uh, and I did receive an email threshold coupon for $8 off your next $40 purchase. So I'm just gonna grab some candy at checkout to get me up to my spend requirement because there really is nothing else I want. So after the checkout candy I grabbed, I was at $39.60. After all my coupons and my eight off 40 come off, it drops me down to $14.60. I'll earn $10 in extra bucks for spending 30, $2 for the UBI Kotex, and $2 for the Suave. Then I'm gonna submit to my husband's Shopkick for a dollar back on the Magic Erasers. Makes everything free plus a 40 cent money maker. Okay, there's one deal, well, it's kind of a deal that I wanted to show you um, just as a reminder because this can get, can get confusing with the double dip that happens at CVS. It does not happen in every store, but it does happen in a lot of stores. So right now, Dove is buy one, get one half price. The Dove body polish is priced at $10.99 in my store. We got buy one, get one freeze on the Dove body polish coupons, and a lot of Fetch accounts have rebates back on these. If you buy these at CVS and you use this buy one, get one free coupon and the cashier takes off the max value of $6.99. We also got a $3 off digital coupon and a lot of people are thinking that that's going to double dip and it's not going to and I'm gonna tell you why. When you scan these two products and then you scan the coupon, the coupon is going to attach to the second product, which for in my store at a price of $10.99, the second one will ring up at $5.49. If the cashier takes off $6.99, then that product of $5.49 that the coupon attached to doesn't have enough value to support the coupon, and then the coupon will go ahead and attach to the first product as well, leaving no product available for the digital coupon to attach to. Therefore, it will not double dip. The only way that digital is coming off for $3 is if the cashier enters the half price amount on the Dove body polish versus the max value of $6.99. Then your paper coupon will take off the half price value and the $3 digital will come off. That would make it a pretty great deal with the fetch bonus. So I hope that was helpful. I know it can get confusing on the double dip with which product the coupon is attaching to and all of that good stuff. All right, we're now gonna run over to Rite Aid and do a quick transaction over at Rite Aid that's gonna be a huge money maker. All right, so Rite Aid has the Nature's Bounty Jelly Bean Vitamins on promotion for buy one, get one free, and buy one, earn back $5 in bonus cash with a limit of four. So I found two of the immunes. I'm gonna grab two of these. One will ring up for $14.99, one will ring up for zero, and they've got them scattered all throughout the vitamin aisle. So I found the multivitamin. I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of these. One will ring up for $14.99, and one will ring up for zero. And that's what happens when you try to grab two with one hand because you're filming. I dropped it, but I grabbed it, so here they are. So these four are gonna total me $29.98. We did just get coupons in our inserts uh, for $2 off any nature made vitamins. I meant to bring four, but I only brought three. Normally a coupon will still work on a free item. Although I did have issues with these coupons that I'll explain to you at the debrief. Um, but I'm gonna earn $20 back in bonus cash for these because it's $5 in bonus cash for every one that you buy with a limit of four. We did have an I bought a rebate, but that seems to be gone. I also have a bonus cash challenge for Nature's Bounty that I'll tell you about in a second. And then the other products I'm going to grab is on the Avizio, Avizio eye drops. They're 25% off. So these ones that are $11.99 will bring up for $8.99 and they are on promotion for buy two, earn back $10 in bonus cash. My friend Mia texted me to let me know that there were $5 printables on the Avizia um, website. So I just went to avizia.com 
and was able to print two $5 off any coupons. Oh my gosh. So these two will total me $17.98. After my $10 in coupons, I'll pay $7.98, earn back $10 in bonus cash, and submit to Ibotta for $3 rebates back with a limit of two. So another $6 back from Ibotta makes these two free plus an 802 moneymaker, but it's gonna get even better. I'm gonna use the $5 off when you spend $25, the flu coupon that's going around. Watch my um, Monday Rite Aid video. I explained a ton in that video. And then I'm also going to use this barcode. We have four different ones available for $10 in bonus cash when you spend $40. So I'm gonna earn back $40 in bonus cash from this transaction and I'm gonna pay for the whole thing just using bonus cash. So I'll have a zero out of pocket. Now I also have a bonus cash challenge. Those are two months long now, um, where if I spend a certain amount on nature's bounty, it is a tiered thing. Um, I'll earn back the bonus cash. You don't get that bonus cash until the promotion ends. Um, but right now I'll be tracking for an extra $6 back in bonus cash. This is going to be a like ridiculously huge moneymaker transaction right here. All right, let's head to the kitchen table and go over uh, this Tuesday haul. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with my CVS transactions and my little Rite Aid transactions. So let's go over my receipts for these. So again, I was so dang excited about the magic eraser. So um, the first transaction I did, I got the downy uh, scent beads, the downy dryer sheets, two of the Mr. Clean and two of the other Mr. Clean my Febreze small spaces, and then my free um, hair ties. So I used those $2 coupons off the Febreze, the one, not Febreze, the $2 coupons off the Mr. Clean, the $1 coupons off the other Mr. Clean, the $2 coupon off of the small spaces. My digital coupons for the Downy products came off, and there's my free beauty gift purchase coming off um, for my September beauty gift. And I used my five off 30. I used a $10 extra buck to pay and that $4 that I don't count because I didn't count it as a reward earned. And my subtotal was $1.31. And I did earn back the $10 in extra bucks for that. And then submitted to Shopkick for the dollar and two cents back. Then did my second transaction grabbed uh, the Downy dryer sheets, the two U by Kotex, the two Febreze plugs, the two Mr. Clean, the two Suave deodorants. Um, yeah, I already said that. And then that was, was what I grabbed at checkout. They're delicious to get me up to my $40. So use the two $5 coupons off the Febreze clubs, plugs, the $2 coupons off the Mr. Clean, my $1 digital off the Downy, I had that eight off 40, and then I used $15 in extra bucks to pay, so that one did lower down to 460, and I had a zero subtotal. I earned back $10 for um, spending 30, $2 for the Suave Deodorant, and $2 for the U by Kotex, and then submitted to my husband's shop kick for a dollar back. I didn't get the scan kicks because I didn't have the device with me to scan it. Oh my gosh. So for um, CVS, I grabbed $75 worth of product. I used $25 in extra bucks to pay, plus had subtotals of $1.31. So I paid $26.31. I earned back $24 in extra bucks, plus uh, $2.02 and two cents from Shopkick. So I earned back $26.02, where I paid $26.31. It makes my cost 29 cents. 29 cents, I will take it for our two favorite uh, scent boosters and dryer sheets and six things of magic erasers. Yes, please. All right, then I moved over to Rite Aid and did this transaction. Now, let me tell you about what happened with the $2 Nature Bounty coupons. I wonder if I have them. Yes, I do. So the cashier scanned uh, this coupon is off of any one nature bounty. One of them went through fine. He scanned the second one. The second one said, Rite Aid, 
limit has been reached for this coupon per Rite Aid's policy or something like that. Like there was no way for them to override it. The cashier was super great. The manager actually came up too. The cashier was like, you're such a nice lady. I wish there was something I could do. He said, the only thing we could do is take two of them off and then let's do them in a separate transaction so that you can use the coupon. And I said, well, I don't wanna do that because you know I already planned my transaction and I'm using my $10, earning $10 back when I spend 40 and that would take me under 40. And he's like, I understand, like, what do you want me to do? I even asked the manager, I said, can we just do a post void um, where you, or not a post void, a coupon, a post coupon, right? They can do a post coupon where they reimburse you cash for the coupon. And she's like, unfortunately, I can't do that with this one because Rite Aid recently changed their system. I don't know if it's actually true or not, or if these coupons are just being picky. Um, I said, well, I thought Rite Aid's policy was that you will take four like coupons. And she said, well, normally it is, but there are just certain coupons that will only allow us to take one. She scanned the coupon again and like read me the message on the screen. And it was something like, Rite Aid will only accept one per transaction of this coupon or something weird like that. So then I was kind of nervous, like are two of my eyedrop coupons gonna go through? Those went through just fine. So I don't know, it only took one. I already knew it was gonna be a humongous money maker. So I just went ahead with the transaction. Um, it has nothing to do with the free item because it wouldn't even take the second one and I paid for two. So because I knew I was going to have a moneymaker, I just said, that's fine. Let's just go ahead with just the one coupon. If I would have known that, I would have structured my transaction differently. I would have done the other ones in a separate transaction. I actually probably would have went ahead and grabbed the Dove Body Polish again, but my, this store didn't have any. So anyways... There's my two Avizio eye drops for $8.99 each with both of my $5 coupons. There's one of the Nature Made Jelly Beans with a $2 coupon. There's my $5 flu coupon. The other one rang up for zero. And then there's my second one rang up for $14.99 and the fourth one ringing up for zero. So my subtotal was $30.96. I just used bonus cash to pay and I earned back $40 in bonus cash. So it tells you right down at the bottom what you were awarded. I was awarded bonus cash for the um, Nature's Bounty four times and $10 for the Avizio eye drops, and then the social barcode, which is I think Rite Aid's Facebook page barcode. 40 dang dollars. So I paid $30.96, earned back $40 in bonus cash, just use bonus cash to pay, zero out of pocket. Submitted to Ivata for $6 back. And I should be tracking for $6 back on my bonus cash challenge. It makes this little teeny transaction here a humongous $21.04 money maker. Oh my goodness. I have to think about if I want to do one more transaction because I have one more barcode I can use for the spend 40, earn back the $10 in bonus cash. And that flu coupon is expiring at the end of the week, so I could use that as well. I have to think about it. But seriously, watch my Monday Rite Aid video if you have a Rite Aid nearby. I know not everybody does. Uh, I explained a lot of things in that video and I've been getting these every transaction too. $5 off when you spend 35. So that's kind of cool as well. I've just been using the flu coupon while it's still available, but there you go. I had over a $20 moneymaker couponing haul today, basically a freebie at CVS, which was awesome because I really wanted those magic erasers and then a huge moneymaker over at Rite Aid. Congratulations again to the insert winners. So excited for you. I love doing giveaways on this channel, so stay tuned for the next giveaway. Thank you to all of you that entered, 
and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I'm going to see you again soon.